Hey everybody, welcome to another episode of Night Witches. So this weekend, um, I want to try and get uh, as much sea bells as I can and do a major overhaul of our mechs. We're, they're pretty well laid out right now, but I think I do definitely want to get an XL engine in, the Clan XL engine we have, probably in the old Hunchback, um, only because it's going to give us like 8 tons, but we need like a million sea bills for that. The contracts we have on this planet shouldn't be... Um, with that, uh, sorry, with the contracts on this planet, it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Uh, there's lots of stuff here we can take. I think what I want to do first, though, is do stealing as a form of flattery against pirates here. It's 1.38 million, um, maximum salvage 417. I think we can probably um, negotiate this to, yeah, like 1.15 or 1.11 million and then get one out of five salvage. Um, and handle this mission without too much of a problem. So let's deploy this and get it done. Alright, here we go. Tundra environment. Awesome. It's going to help us manage our heat without too much of a problem. So we're going to capture this base, hold it, and then uh, that'll be that. Let's get, to fighting. let's get to moving first. So we're just going to head straight up here. So there's a few things that we're still looking for. Things like light engines and stuff would be nice. Clan XL engines would be nice. Um, we still need another uh, fire control system uh, energy for um, the Hunchback H. This one right here to help with the uh, medium pulse lasers a little bit more. Um, so yeah, there's a few things that I like to grab, which is why I like to like not um, um, worry too much about salvage and stuff. Uh, Megasaur. Um, or like worried like about not taking salvage. I like taking at least one piece of salvage on these big missions because uh, you never know something good might drop. So I want to at least have a chance to get that. Let's get right in here. Okay, where? I don't see anybody. I don't see anybody. There we go. Oh, turrets. Of course. Wow. That was really bad. Megasaur. Let's get down into here. See the A pod off. All right, fire on this guy. Wow. Wow. Full speed it. Let's get in here. I want to kill these turrets as fast as, fast as I can here, I think. Um, Taking the shot. Gotta be careful. Reporting minimal damage. Oh, we gotta kill that turret. That's this guy here, I think. So we need to get Baby Aga on that turret now. Now, 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 now. We'll be able to kill this one here. Oh, stop. Stop, stop. Check to see if the turrets are online. No kidding, Darius, they're shooting at us already. Dude. Okay, almost got that one. Ms. Flowers? Let's multi-target this. Let's try and take this turret and do some damage to this one. So A and B and fire. Nice shooting. Again nice shooting. Almost got that turret. Okay Comet. Let's get into... Mm, we see the other turret? From here we can. So I'm going to multi-target this up and A and B, B 
B will take those guys and fire. fire it. Wow, at least one of them hit. Megasaur. Let's get in here. I still see I still hear that horn going off. Oh, that's not good. Two ER PPCs and a rotary five, huh? We better hit. Wow. They didn't shoot? I guess they couldn't see us. Copy that. That's bonus for us. Yes, Commander. Bonus for us. Aye, aye. Taking the shot. There we go. There we go. Maybe we can get the tag on this thing. Come on. Targot. There we go. Yep, saw the tag hit. Nice. At least it looked like it did. Could be totally wrong though. Let's just go stand right by this thing. What's up, buddy? What is up? How do you like those 99.1% chances to hit? Well, uh, I know where they're coming. They're coming from that side. Pretty sure of it anyway. Um, uh, want to keep our firepower together here. And our ECMs together and our stuffs together. Our shit together. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, backing up. So, my goal with this hunchback, um, if we can put the XL, uh, the Clan XL engine in this thing, because it's got a primitive engine right now built in, um, it'll give us like eight tons, which means that means boomstick time, guys. Boomstick's only 10 tons, man. We can boomstick it up. That's what I want to do. Well, yeah, let's go see if we can see him. Beep, beep, beep. What do we got here? Okay, you're going on 17. Hunchback on 16. It's the Serum back. Ambusher. Bah. Commando. And a cat. <laughs> cattle master, eh? Well, I can't shoot that guy. So let's hammer this guy. And fire. That's a weak start, but it, it is a start. Um, I know they got good defense at this point, but I want to get some good evasion up and running here. Wow. That'll fire everything. Oh, we got one hit. I could have just let them go, but you know, it's my uh, reputation at stake here. Something like that. What's up, boss? Yeah, nothing's in range for Megasaur. Megasaur can reserve. Waiting for the shot. Waiting for the shot. We want to kill this ambusher fast, I think, if we can. So we're gonna get right on him next turn. Yeah, you ain't got nothing. You ain't got nothing. I think we should try. Uh, somebody mentioned before we should get like four hunchbacks going. Make it the hunchback pack. Um, yeah, let's get into here. Wow. All right, fire on this guy. Not that good. Good enough, though. Crapple Master. Well, Damage is light. thanks for thanks for coming out, buddy. Commander. 
Let's get into punching range. Shoot this guy. Yeah, firing. Shot up a lot of ice. You know what would be cool? Hit the lasers if it actually hit ice, if it reflected. Even part of the laser beam would reflect off the ice. But, whatever. I'm sure there are other changes like the modders could be making other than that. Ace pilot. Good move, buddy. Good move. Because I'm crazy and fearless, we're gonna go spear this guy. 42%, eh? Yeah, let's shoot this guy. And yeah, firing. Commander? I know he's bulwark, but. Uh, this assassin is going to get, like, targeted. Roger. Let's get a lot of speed up. Get some height. Wow. These chances to hit. ECM jam, man. Alright, we're firing this guy. Roger that. Wow. Yeah, yeah, no shit, man. Commander. No shit, Sherlock. Huh. Get into here. I want to get my stability back and give them a target. Um, let's rip this guy a new one. Just because we can. Solid connection on that one. Okay, we got Megasaur left. You're ever in a hunchback, do not turn your back to an enemy melee mech. Dude, you have like no armor on your back. <sighs> Ready for orders. And I wanted to punch this guy too. Let's do it, see if we can finish this guy off in one turn. Uh, you had to hit the arm, eh? My A pod is empty. My flamer is empty. The arm, huh? You're gonna kick his arm off. Ow! Stop scratching my paint. What's this ambusher doing? He's ambushing. No, he's not. He's... Uh... What? Uh, where is he going? Sometimes the AI is just... The AI is just so confusing sometimes. See, now that's a smart move. Right? Maybe because this guy was in the thick of things, he backed up? I, I, I don't even know what to say to that.
Make us start going on 17. I think we're probably, yeah, we're going before their hunchback. So. I'm going to do this. Not really great chance to hit, but far better than before. Still hit with a ton, though. All right. You cheeky monkey. MRM 30? Morning. Detecting mech warrior injury. Clan heat bank explosion. Fuck me. Got what you deserve, you bastard. I needed that clan heat bank. Mech destroyed. Yes, God Commander. damn it. Location confirmed. Firing full complement on him. Ah oh, man. Inflicted some heavy damage. Now you got me mad. Sometimes taking those attacks of opportunity puts you in a bad position. Although I don't think I could have really stopped that from happening. But, whatever. <laughs> they should have the mech slide across the ice. Sorry. <laughs> He's hiding! He's hiding! <laughs> He's like, maybe if I hide in this corner they won't see me. I'll just hide over here. <laughs> I don't blame you, buddy. Ow, 42, man. Order. Two for two. Tag, you're it. I can't believe I lost the... Oh... I don't even know what that guy was shooting at me. What's up, boss? These guys are both trying to hide. Roger. Don't blame you guys, I'm sorry. <laughs> Look at you, you're just so damaged. 96, 80, like it's the same. Uh, I can do more damage, probably. Let's shoot this guy up. I copy. Yeah, we saw you there, buddy. I better get something good out of this. All right, see if we can finish this guy up. That's a kill. That is a kill. I take my anger out on this cattle master. Death by association. Death by association. There it is, folks. Uh, let's go home and cry at the damage. Mission successful. Was it really? Well, contract payment was increased by 10%, which is good because it covers our drop costs. So that's a bonus. Uh, we took a lot of damage in the leg here. Um, yeah, clan heat bank. The only thing, the best thing, like... 
God damn it. We better get something good out of this. That's all I gotta say. Everybody else is okay? Alright. Oh, man. <laughs> oh. LBX 20 cluster double. Okay, we're planning on putting that uh, boomstick in. So there's our there's our thing right there. We only had one ton of ammo, so this is going to give us another what? 12 shots. So that's that's a bonus. So we'll take that. God, there's like nothing here we could have taken. Ah, look at the garbage. Well, we got a patchwork material too. That's a bonus. Nice. All right, 37,000 in repair, so not too bad. The ambusher was really the only thing that was a threat in that match. Uh, let's get the Wolverine up for, oh, it doesn't really matter. It's going to be 11 days for repairs. How much to find out report? 19. So we can get one more mission in. Babiaga's out till for 15 days, so we'll wait for, for her to be back too. Um, climate systems. Fan controls again. Well, let's just fix the whole thing, because why not? Get our morale up a little more. Yeah, we're still discouraged, but we'll work on getting that up. We'll bring in three, two, one. Okay, so let's take a look what we can replace that with. Ah, really? I just want to cry now. That was a good... Ah. That was one ton. Well, and that a punch in the face. One double heat sink left. Got to throw that in. It's not going to help all that much, but well, it's still not that bad, I guess. Could be worse. Three days for repairs. That's all right. We got to get uh, Baba Yaga back anyway. Yeah, four days. Okay. So now we got to figure out another mission to take here. So we could take um, Code of Silence. It's a nice, nice payout. But I think this should be the mission that we take once we get our mechs up and running. So we're at maximum uh, capability here. So let's have another quick look. This is a capture base from the Draconis Combine. We don't want to do that. Stubborn Surrender. Um, Outworld Alliance would be fighting. Hot Landing. It's a heavy lance. Stop the signal. Destroy a base. That's uh, Kurita though. Take the bait. Don't want to do that. Um, Hot landing? Nah, it's a heavy land, so I don't want to take let's take let's take this one. And we'll go this road again. Yeah, let's go this route. And I think we're gonna mm, assassin again. Yeah, we're on a cold world, so flamers aren't gonna do all that much. So let's just deploy it this way. And get this sucker done. Alright. Could be two lances here. Don't like this map. But we will deal. Commander. Let's take the high ground again. Let's go this way. Want to stay hull down here, best we can, till the enemy uh, shows themselves. Standing by. Dun 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 dun. Megasaur. No yeah, once that uh, boom sticks on here, it's going to be a nightmare for the enemy. We do have slug rounds too, LBX slug rounds, I believe. I know we've got the. Um, oh, you know what? I think it's LBX 10 slug. I don't think it's the 20 slug. That's fine though. 
Bushwhacker. That is somebody we don't want to get close to right away. Waiting for the right play. Yeah, we certainly are. Jenner. Okay. Yes, Commander. I think we want to try something different here. I don't want to get up where that whacker can see us. I want to be in point blank range with that guy. Problem with the bushwhacker is like, once again, it's just, just massive firepower. A white. Okay, so he's one of the guys we want to take out. If we can, see if we can tag him. Nope. A whole lot of, nah. -uh. You most certainly did. Let's get down here. Wolverine, same thing. Oop. Well, how far can we go? Pretty damn fast. Let's try and take advantage of our speed here. That puts us in back striking distance of this white, although the bushwhacker might see us, but we'll play it by ear. See how we do. Yeah, we got shit rolls. It's because we reserved so much, probably. Okay, I don't know what he's doing. Yeah. It's kind of better that they move first. I want to see what they're up to. There's a white. Yeah, that's a smart move. Really smart move. Forces us to close, which puts us in, in bushwhacker nightmare range. Well, Miss Flowers. You don't have melee attack yet. Ready for orders. So. I know this is putting us in bushwhacker range, but we need to get on these guys. There's. Oh, they got an ambusher too. Uh, yeah, man. We got to get on this guy right now. Wow, look at the chances to hit. Fire on this guy. Are we in Megasaur range yet? We are not in Megasaur range. Now we need a full sprint. Acknowledged. We gotta do it this way. That Jenner's trying to get some height on us. Uh, leaving the A-pod off. Wow, we're like right in this guy's ECM bubble here. But we're here to melee. Okay, got a tag on that guy. That's good. Yaga. Uh, do I want to try and take a turn? Oh. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait. What is this? This is possibilities. This is possibilities. Let's get up here. I don't want them to all shoot on the same guy. Okay, those are good chances to hit. We're gonna take them. Yes, Commander. If you get within ambush or range, you're gonna be in a lot of trouble. Let's get right behind the hunchback. Confirmed. Let's just fire on this guy. We'll use everything. You never know, you might get lucky and get a headshot too, right? <laughs> yeah, right. If I can miss with a 99% chance to hit, I sure as hell can hit with a like 0.9% chance to hit. Okay, these guys are fast. At least we got okay rolls this time, kind of. 
Who's going first? Jenner? The white. Oh. Oh, yeah, man. That's basically a free move. I think we want to stay on the front of this guy. Or on the side of him. Pretty damn good chances to hit from there. Oh! Oh! Look at this. Dude, you committed suicide. Not quite. He's got good back armor. Lucky for him. He's keeping our eyes off the prize here. Why are you meleeing? Probably have... You know what it is? I bet you the our ECMs and our movement are just messing with these guys. They probably have the same crappy chance to hit that we did. I mean, look at, well, that's actually pretty good hits there. Oh, you destroyed my hand. I was about to slap you with that hand, too. It's okay, Megasaur will just have to do it now. Um, what do we want, the Bushwhacker? or the, I think this Ambusher is the most evil of the two. 69% on the Ambusher. 92 on the Bushwhacker from behind. It's going to give that Ambusher a chance at point blank, though. But if we miss this attack, it's just a complete waste. Let's just do it. Moving to position. Come on, one shot. Yeah, there it is, folks. Hostile eliminated. My flamer is empty. Okay, we can't get the assassin anywhere near this uh, this ambush, or we're going to be in trouble here. So, follow up on the back attack. Okay, how's that guy gone? Mech destroyed. He's just Order. taking a bit of a dirt nap. Whoa, we can't get behind him. But what we can do... Oh. At least this way... It's going to be tougher for them to get behind our other hunchback here. Kind of block the back a little bit here. Let's just fire on this guy. Okay. What do we got going on here? Who's moving? Jenner? Megasaur is going on 20. Oh. Oh, he's going. Crap. Did his... What the hell? Did his... Oh, he's splitting fire. That's what it is. God damn it. I lost a weapon. Yeah, he lost the whole right torso. I don't know what this guy's got on him. I have no idea what the weapon is. No idea. Order. Acknowledged. Screw you. Ready 
for orders. God. I lost three weapons. This guy's a complete rebuild now. that it'll make a difference. Quick step in it. I know we said we shouldn't do this, but I don't think this guy's going to survive the turn, so... Hey, buddy, you want to see what a fuck you looks like? God damn it, it's two missions in a row where that the mech is like cost us so much. All I want to do is refit my mechs. Why are you costing me so much stuff? We may have to put off ref like well, I guess we can't put off doing a proper refit now. It might not be proper, but it'll be a refit nonetheless. Um Let's just try and put him back a turn. Okay, minus three initiative. Maybe that'll be enough for the rest of our guys to go on him. Waiting for orders. On it. God, I'm so upset. If anybody knows what weapon that ambusher has in there, it's like an ultra AC twenty or ultra. I have no idea what the hell it is. Ultra Boomstick or something. I'm receiving you. Whatever it is, it's freaking crazy. Roger, Skipper. Kicking it. Okay, we don't have enough juice to kill this guy, unfortunately, but Target at least we're all in close. I'll take the Thermal Barrack, that's fine. Yeah, let's show, show this guy what happened to his buddies. Tag, you're it. Waiting for orders. Confirmed. Holding. Confirmed. Can we shoot anything? Tag? Sure, why not? Yeah, I even miss with that. <sighs> God. So disappointed. They better have a pulse laser or something I can take. He's got nine health? Next time we go for the ambusher first. Always the ambusher first. If I don't, just put a slap in the uh, comment section down below. Medium pulse we can take. Fire control Artemis. God, I'm so... Ah, pisses me off. Upper missile actuator we don't need. LBX, yeah, he must have a an ultra LBX or something. The only thing I can think of, and it must be in integral to the mech, too. Because it doesn't drop. Uh, but then we pretty much destroyed him, so... I don't know. Let's see if we get some whacker parts here. We got another ambusher part. Great! Alright, great, great. And a pair of LRM... 5s? A pair of LRM 5s, really? God! You know, I feel like I pulled up to an ATM machine. Look at this! I feel like I pulled up to an ATM machine to deposit some money and then turn around and get back in my car and someone stole my car. <sighs> really? 
Oh, frustrating. The back's got to get up here right away. Although, you know, if we get the other mechs back first, five days, we can take another mission with the uh, Hunchback out. We still got four mechs. Let's see if we can take something real quick here today before we end this episode, because that's just frustrating. Got a new financial report for you, Commander. Yeah, why not? Just keep taking my money. Keep taking it. All right. Let's, at least we didn't have any pilots injured. That's a good thing. Is there any low contracts here? Uh, deniable destruction. Yeah, we're, we're PO'd right now. Let's go blow up a base. Negotiate this. Gonna do the same thing, just in case. God, it just really, really... Ah, man. Well, you know what? Red Comet's been doing well in the Assassin. Let's get uh, Sunflower and the Firestarter. Alright, let's see what we can do. You know what it is? I was in a good mood today when I came home thinking, yeah, it's Friday night. All right, got the weekend off. Let's do some stuff this weekend. Going to be doing some stuff with the kids this weekend. It's going to be a great weekend. And then, you know, you go to just relax for a bit and someone punches you right in the groin. Yes, Commander. So let's do some groin punching of our own. Let's hope Commander? they don't have Quick any initial base guards. Find out in a second. So I guess we're re-outfitting the other hunchback then. The punchback actually isn't that bad. What do we got here? Phoenix Hawk, 45 tons, half armor. Uh, Waiting for orders. Nah, we're gonna reserve. They got turrets too, so. Holding for tactical advantage. See what they do. Wow, we got lousy rolls again. Valiant, great. Zephyr, that's not so bad. Let's reserve. I think we go after that Valiant first. Vedette, okay, not bad. I was hoping we'd be able to see that guy. Whole lot of nothing. Reporting negative damage. Burn up those trees a little bit, buddy. Burn them trees. Oh, I can barely even see here. 27s. That's much better. Let's hammer this guy. Nice. Enemy destroyed. One last problem we gotta worry about. VSPL? Well, at least you're making brighter around us. Okay, Comet, let's get in on this vehicle. How far can you go? Oh, you're way back there, though. Phoenix Hawk hasn't gone yet. We get eyes on him yet? Not yet. Great. Zephyr firing. Okay, a little bit of damage. Who's got the horns for me? Alright, firing. Sorry guys, I know it's going to get annoying real fast. I left the A-Pod on. Yeah. It's not going to be much use anywhere else here. How much armor does this guy have? I have no idea. Do 44 by stepping, or a hell of a lot more by flamer. Death by flamer? Got it. Death by flamer.
What a way to go. Reporting vehicle destroyed. You know the uh, British in World War II. If you've ever if you've ever seen the crocodile, the uh, the um, Churchill that was outfitted with the flamethrower. They used to give the Germans a, a chance to get away because death by flamethrower is one of the most horrific things, right? So they used to murder any uh, crews that were in um, the tanks that were like flamethrower tanks and stuff. So um, what they would do is rather than burning them right away, they would just shoot the flame fuel straight at the bunkers or whatever. And the flame fuel uh, was enough for the uh, guys inside to just go, we're getting the hell out of here. Kind of gave them a chance to get away or at least surrender before being completely incinerated. Because it's a horrific way to die. Not that I've ever died that way, of course, but, you know, could you just imagine being completely uh, engulfed in flames like that? With a fluid that's, like, gonna stick to you, right? So no matter where you go, you're gonna be burning. Step on the front. Nice. Yeah, those things like the the Churchills, the crocodiles used to have a uh, cart that they used to tow behind them too, full of flamer fuel. I guess it's a lot better than carrying it on the inside. Okay. What's this guy doing? He yeah, hasn't got much left. Just bail out! Stop being so dumb. Dumba. Well, he wants to be dumb. Alright. Let's burn him alive! Burn him alive! Solid connection on that one. He's all yours. We're going for the turrets. Okay, now this guy had... He had the VSPLs? He's got, no, he had the medium pulses. No, it's on this guy. This guy had the VSPLs, I think. I think. Let's multi-target this. Got 90. So I think if we go this route, we get lucky, we should be able to destroy them both. Wow, you serious? Okay, we got that one. Moving real fast. Let's get lucky, hopefully. Oh, nicely done. Turret eliminated. I'm receiving you. Just in case that guy tries to shoot me in the back. All right, fire on this guy. Nice. Might as well fire. Light damage, Commander. Receiving you. Roger. Should do it. There we go. Both legs gone. Nice. We might get some salvage out of that. We might. We might yet, Mr. Frodo. We might yet. Turret Buster. Busting some turret. I know we probably got a split fire on that, but let's just make sure it goes away. Uh, yeah, let's take this. Take this one. 
target locked. Enemy structure damage. It's not history though. Standing by. You punch any of these guys? I copy. Medium. Just hit the large. Locking on target. Ready for orders. Let's get this done and go home, please. Commander. Can I get? Oh, I can't. Of course I can't. That should do it though. A and B. Thanks for the update. Because I had no idea. And another target. Let's go home. Well, we're walking out cool as butter. Okay, well, I didn't make up for it, but 738,000, okay. <sighs> we didn't take any damage, I'm not worried about that. Alright, so, lots of parts. Pirate AC-10, ER mediums, no medium pulse lasers, because of course there wouldn't be... Ooh, combat shield, it's only minus 5% damage, though. <sighs> Reduce visibility. Hey, internal combustion engine, why not? XL Gyro, well, that would be probably be worth it. Let's just drop it there for now. Double heatsink kits. Impact resistant, eh? Minus 35% reduced melee damage, hits taken. Minus 50% reduced critical hits. That's kind of cool. Heavy Pharaoh, though. Ah. Uh, Still got a double heatsink. I'm gonna take the XL gyro. I think we can use that oh, supercharger. Walk well, and sprint distance. TSMs are nice. Uh, let's just go this route. Phoenix Hawk part. Okay. ER medium. Internal combustion. So a couple things we can sell there. Well, one thing we can sell anyway. All right. No damage really. So I think what we'll do next episode when we come back uh, is we're gonna get. This is 24 days, eh? So we have about one and a half mil to spend to repair stuff. So I think what we'll do next episode when we come back is we'll get the, the melee, the punch back up and running. Um, we can certainly do that first. Um, kind of set us back a bit, but that'll give us some time to get a bit more sea bills as well. So maybe we get the other hunch back up and running um, and then go after some sea bills, get this one back and refit this one. Yeah, I think that's what we'll have to do. And then go hunting for mech parts. We can start punching in the two and a half, three range now. So that's really, really good. We should start getting some medium mechs and into the heavy mechs. So be looking for parts for those. All right. So we're going to leave the episode there. If you like it, drop a like. Um, if you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe and drop any comments in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.